All right, boys. Today we're going to start the Merc. I know it turns over because even with the old shitty battery, it would at least roll. I'm having a problem with fuel delivery. All the fuel in the line going back to the tank has evaporated out. Fuel pumps are notoriously wimpy in uh, this flathead engine. In fact, some people will sometimes put a wedge or a penny or small sliver of metal on top of the uh, on top of the arm to get a little bit more uh, oomph out of the out of the vacuum there, out of the suction. So I think what I'm going to do is detach my uh, bulb, priming bulb, and um, hook up to the fuel line that goes back to the tank. Pour some gas down until it hits the tank so that it's kind of a reverse prime, if you will, or priming the other side. And then hook all this shit back up, and hopefully once the car starts, it'll have enough uh, suction to um, get the fuel flow going. I'm also going to fill up the bowl by hand like I did last time with this bulb pump so that it will uh, start. That's the theory. I should check the oil, although there isn't any puddles, but that would be very wise. Fuck if I remember. Oh yeah, there's... Um, it's been... I would say it's been almost a year since I started this. Last time I started it, the battery freaking died, and it will not accept a charge anymore, so... It's been a while, bought that battery, crappy tire. Um, I'm hoping to be non-eventful, but uh, really I need to get... The tank's probably half empty anyway, but... Or more the tank's probably quite empty, but um, all the yeah, I need I need some fuel on the line in order to get the suction happening. All right, so uh, I'll set you up somewhere and we'll start on this. This is the new bulb. The other one uh, over the course of the winter, temperatures and shit. It doesn't get a lot of sunlight in here, but um, it got all hard and shitty. So that'd be no good out on the uh, out on the water, now would it? I think I just need to take off the one side because it's just sucking air, right? Oh, it's a tiny bit in there, though. Where'd that come? So I'm thinking of hooking a funnel up here and just pouring gas down until it fills that up. All right, I got some chainsaw gas there for extra lubricity. I think it's a 30 to one. It's old though, but so is what's in the tank. This is newer than what's in the tank for sure. This gas smells pretty good. I think the oil may have uh, stabilized that shit. Now I wonder if I need the wife out here as a spotter. I guess I'm gonna know when it's full but such a long tube that it's still gonna have a shit ton in it if I feel overfill. I really need to shorten this tube a little bit I think make that problem less. I wonder where my fucking tube cutters are. I have actually have a pair of those. Let me check the valiant. Some of the tools might be in the uh, trunk of the Merc here which I can't get in at right now because uh, reasons. I'm just gonna give her a little splash. Oh yeah, it's coming outside. Fuck. Well, it's not like I didn't know that was gonna happen, but I just I was hoping it wouldn't. I need to adapt the funnel to get it right into that. You know what I'm gonna do? Fuck. I'm an idiot. I'm gonna take this pump. I'm gonna put it in there. And I'm gonna put the other end of that in the fucking gas. May have to turn this around. I don't know if it'll allow. I, don't, I think it has a uh, check valve. That seems like an awful lot of gas to go in there. I mean, the line's only 10 feet long. Drank this whole fucking, well, three quarters of a can of dry bottle. I might have to check the pump, make sure I'm not just pumping this out into space. Yeah, if there was a break in that fuel line, let's say, somewhere under the car, I might be just pumping it into there. Well, I don't see anything. 
Okay, I'm gonna let that stuff evaporate off. Oh shit. And uh, I'll be back, I'll hook up the battery. We'll fuck with the ignition inside the car. Put that 12 volt battery on so that we can press the button or I'll press it from out here. We know the engine turns over, so that's good. Talk to you in a bit. Bye. Fake recess, motherfuckers. It's a good Friday today, so class is not in session. Okay, now I'm not convinced we're getting spark. <clears throat> Check the points. Probably just corroded. <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna shut, kill the ignition. We'll have a look. Christ. It's fucking new in there. Check that out. Yeah, nothing wrong with that cap, just looks gnarly. I must have put these points in. Your dad or dad had it done. Or on some sandpaper throughout. I've never once timed this car. <laughs> yeah, son. She's, she's right there, boys. Okay. Fuck with that all morning. So we'll try um, now. Alright, that's beauty. 
I'm happy at least did it. The idle's all wonk, we'll, we'll tune it up. But I'm glad the pump is bumping and... Actually, probably good to use that uh, two-stroke oil that I had, you know. A wee bit of extra lubricant. Got any smoke here? Oh, fuck. <laughs> All right. I run out of gas. All right, anyway, we had a successful start. Let's not push our luck. Well, that's, I'm glad about that. You know, after the, any of these cars, after they sit so long, all kinds of shit can happen. But the Merc lives for another day. I'll have to get this fucking thing sorted out, this whole 12 volt thing. I do have that new, uh, quote unquote, six volt solenoid. So maybe I'll really just get into that on a job and see if we can solve this fucking battery thing once and for all. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm happy. I, uh, I'm happy that that went about as easy as it was gonna. Um, I think the points did need, uh, you didn't see that from in here, but in the other camera you'll see uh, the points did need uh, some sandpaper put between them. They obviously had uh, gummed up over the winter wrote it a little bit because afterward uh, after that it started right away or at least tried to start anyway thanks for watching all and uh, I'll be back soon now that the Merc started we're going to uh, start to do some more things on this and get it up into some kind of shape boys all right have a good one bye